so there's basically no place in Thailand that I can confidently say no other foreigner has been except for me except for this market which is absolutely huge and I'm pretty sure no other Westerner has ever set foot here absolutely massive place with like a ton of stuff it's actually insane if you ever need like a ton of bananas there is a million tons of them first of all i don't know if i'm supposed to wear a mask or not because how big people are it's so big people are scooting around people have bicycles like it's huge and yeah i've never seen so many pineapples in one spot in my life Was it pretty nerve-wracking to go in there knowing that I'd be the only farmer? Yes, but not because it's like unsafe or anything, just because it's awkward. Like everyone is staring at you, every single human. And when you try and buy things, no one wants to help you because they're nervous of the English. Um, but yeah, the point and like ask how much it is in Thai method worked out really well. I managed to get exactly what I came for, which is a bunch of brindles. This one is going off, which is sad, and that one has a little bit of mold, so does that one. But that's just the tips. Cut it off, we proceed, still good as new. Uh, obviously this one, I'm just going to toss it, I'm not going to cut the tip off of that one. And then an entire bag of carrots. For context, this is 110 baht. Usually I pay like 30 to 40 baht for two or three carrots. So that's a massive saving. And then I'm pretty sure these oats saw I was foreign and decided to rip me off. Uh, I got five whole pawpaws do i need five whole pawpaws probably not so yeah i got five whole pawpaws for 285 baht which is about 50 well would have been 57 baht per pawpaw but then they gave me five baht extra change back um but yeah i'm pretty sure that is not what everyone else here is paying but these had price tags on and it's the main reason i bought them is anything with the price tag i will buy because i know i'm not being ripped off those things I should definitely have bought from one of the million other pawpaw sellers. They make somtam here with unripe pawpaw, so very few of the pawpaws were actually ripe. I specifically went to the store for ripe pawpaws and I got overcharged, but I'm okay with it. It's still cheaper than I would have paid back where I'm from, so yeah. Overall a good day, but a little bit like scary. I don't think I'll ever come back here, but I am really excited about these brindles. I will definitely not even be able to find them if I ever come back here. I don't know how I got here. I went through like a residential area after leaving the market and then came back to the market. So yeah, I don't know how to get out of here. That's my next mission. Yeah. <laughs>